Hey everybody, DSJ here, the one and only Ultimate Nerd. Welcome back to Mega Man Zero. And we're gonna finish this. Yeah. In the last video, I kind of went all ranty because, well, it's more or less like, how dumb are y'all? Y'all couldn't piece any of this together? All right. We have to go to the transceiver at this point. Yeah, change area. The Arcadia, let's do this. Okay. I'm f they giving me the pretty much the the two annoying on robots, the dog and them vultures. Ugh. Nope. Ah, oh, come on. Okay. Already getting annoying. These are not even the real bosses here. Already over. Hmm. I think I'm getting close to the annoying part. No. Go away. You're not the boss there either. Eh, yeah. This is something I didn't miss from the classic series. Come on!
Okay. Time my jumps. Oh, yeah, made it. Nope. Almost fell. Yeah, I'm awake. Huh. Good. I didn't royally screw that up that time. Why do I have a weird feeling your weakness is ice? Come on. No? Or is it fire? Nope, you're immune to that. Somewhat neutral. No, it is ice. I just didn't charge it all the way. Goodbye. Oh good, I still got a grade of A. Alright, I won't push myself. Yeah, that's the only mission you're gonna get, just the Arcadia from this point. I always like the lightning element. Yay, elevator! I think I should have equipped myself though with a triple rod at least. Oh well. Oh, that took care of the ride. Wow. And I got hit like that. What? The? Okay. Eh. Nobody hit me, and I still fell. There. I don't have a weirdest feeling that these are supposed to be spikes right there. Or they might not be, I don't know. Oh well.
No. I am not taking a big drop. Oh, good. Oh, this looks painful. Ow. No. Come on! I wanna... I don't wish I wanted to that hit. Ow. No. Thank you, Miss Billy Frank. Oh, no. The Rainbow Devil. I get rid of you. Why do you still even exist? Oh, my grade actually dropped to a B. I, I don't understand. Uh, whatever. It's. This game don't know how to grade sometimes. See, uh, what you doing here? Here's the thing I kind of don't get. This line right here. I have a feeling it's a um, translation error because the implications of it. She said it was I who recreated the duplication of X. And almost made it sound like she did this before. Can I just talk to you? No. Oh, yeah, I can. Let's begin mission. All right. Now we're in the core. Boss rush time. Yeah, you're immune to lightning. But your weakness is fire. But you're sand. I don't understand that. Ow. I would have thought ice would have made a better weakness for you. Nope. 
Uh, he's already gone. Wow, that didn't take long at all with you. I didn't even lose any health. What? Here we go with you. Here we go with you again. Maverick, whose name I forgot. <laughs> When it comes to the Mega Man Zero series, I tend to forget about the names of, of these Mavericks, really. I mainly pay attention to the main bad guys. And they're kind of more memorable. Go again. You E Honda wannabe. Goodbye. Next area. Make it up here, you get these goodies at least. Next set of Mavericks. And and out of four guardians. Hyperia. Hyperia, however you pronounce it. Time to take you out first. And this time I got your weakness. Fafnir. I don't know why. I consider this one as basic as they come. Because he does those little pitiful shots. Sometimes grab me and throw me in the air. He always act like he has a hard on to arm um, challenge me. Leviathan's probably next here. Nope. 
Phantom? Huh. You're neutral. So no element. I hate this book set so much. If y'all wonder why you never see him again after this game, this is why. He basically self-destructs. That's why you never see me make a man zero, two, or three. I'm gonna charge you up. Oh, you just start. You just stop my charge when I go in the door. All right, come on, Leviathan. God! Yeah, just go away. Thank you. Take care of the four guardians. Whereas well, now it's down to three. Phantom is no more. I done beat y'all. Hey, Copy X. <laughs> I like how Zero say, you must be the pirate Copy. No, you're not a perfect copy of X by a long shot. If you were, you'd definitely be suffering through how much he whined in Mega Man X7. At least in X8, he pretty much man up right. I know I have to fight, but whew. Uh-huh, sure. Sure, crazy person. Yeah, if you're... Oh, you know what? I already hate you.
Ew. You know what? Let's leave it at neutral. Really? I don't think so. Oh, what do you know, Zero? You got muscle memory. Here's the reason why I like that line so much. When he said the, he just remembered, his body remembers that the original X was my year to him. If you start thinking about what Zero said in Mega Man X1 to X. Talk about you haven't, you know, once you reach your full potential, you might be as strong or maybe even stronger than me. Uh huh. That's a nice callback game. Oh, Lord, here we go. Oh, great! Oh, crap. I'm not doing well. What the fuck? Oh no. Oh, you son of a bitch. Okay. There. I hate the hitbox on this damn boss so much. Luckily, his patterns are that predictable. Fuck off, X. You're not even the real X. You're not no damn perfect copy. Go away. Our defense line has been destroyed. Wait a minute. Let me get this straight. He was a literal lifeline of this core. Okay.
time to go. I like how Zero just like bailed out real quick with that one-liner. I'm sorry, that's just crazy. Time to go. Hmm. Hmm, let's see. Since you disappeared, I've been fighting this war alone against uncountable number of mavericks for nearly a hundred. Wow. Yeah, this one you know this sounds like X, alright. Remember, X always cared. He didn't really want to fight. He wanted to find peace. But we know he has to fight. He will fight. But he, but apparently, he this time he fought so long to the point he just stopped giving a shit. That's actually frightening. Which, if you remember, is ending um from X four. That's the one thing he was afraid of. That he gets to the point that he will he himself will go over the edge and become Maverick himself. Mm. I like how you got a little sage coat. Yeah, that's X's cyber um cyber elf self. It's almost like X handed the torch right back to Zero. Because remember, like, in X1, when Zero sacrificed himself, he handed the torch to X. Now it's like, it came in full circle. It when it went to a full circle. Because now X has handed the torch back to Zero. It's kind of amazing how... The creation of rival scientists end up being the main heroes of the future. But then again, what Wiley said in um, Mega Man 11 makes a lot of sense because Zero is his creation. That was Mega Man Zero. I'm not gonna lie. I am grateful for the casual um casual scenario mode as well as um save assist mode. Cause I used to own the original Game Boy Advance card. And Oh boy. Matter of fact, when I got my second Game Boy Advance, because my first one, I lost it during my freshman year in college. So when I actually got enough money to get the, my second one, here were the. F I'm going to name the, the two games I got for that Mega Man and Base. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> and Mega Man Zero. I'm not gonna lie. I thought the Mega Man Zero series was gonna focus more on Zero's origins, you know, 
with him being on Wiley's final creation and somehow, you know, Wiley will find a way to muck up everything for him, but yeah, um, ever since, well, X5, really, anything dealing with Wiley just went by the wayside. Granted, I, th I think Isaac from Mega Man X6 definitely had some Wiley influences. But, yeah, direct references to Wiley, I ain't see that since Mega Man X5. But you know what? I kind of like it. I kind of like the fact that folks don't own Zero as his own character versus, you know, him dealing with the fact that he is Wiley's creation. Because what it boils down to, really. Zero made the conscious decision of being a hero. Granted, he fought Sigma when he was still, you know, crazed. And end up, you know, inadvertently releasing the virus. But still, he still made the choice of being a hero. He could have stayed Maverick if he wanted to, but he didn't want to. Well, what's my final grade, game? You love to grade me. What's my final grade? A B. Really? Whatever. I'll take his bed than what I got in my first save file, which is a friggin' F. Well, I guess I'll see you next time when I play Mega Man Zero 2. This game's direct sequel. This was DSJ. I remember everybody, let's all nerd the heck out. See you guys next time.